All right, well, the weather pattern has flip-flopped across the nation for the last month plus. Haven't seen much going on out west, while on the other hand, out east was all cold with a series of storm systems. Now, east is all nice and warm, and now we have a big trough of low pressure out across the western United States. The storm system that went through last night already up into the Rockies exiting Colorado. Just a quick blast of a little bit of moisture for us. The second storm system now winding up off California does not look like it's going to be going east but it looks like it's going to be going south right into Mexico. In the meantime, today, cooler temperatures. As we've been talking about temperatures way above average for so long. Today, 43 degrees, just a few degrees above the average for this time of year. 19 last night, a hundredth of an inch since midnight last night. But the storm total is right around a quarter of an inch of precipitation for us in Flagstaff. And hey, we'll take it because it's been a long time coming. Still a little bit below average on the calendar year. Three quarters of an inch below average for this day. Okay, we zoom in on the storm system. Here we are in Arizona, a mostly cloudy day. The main low pressure dropping in and winding up right off San Diego. This is a strong storm system, and it's just a shame that it's not going to move straight to the east and through us because it would be a big precipitation uh, maker. But this thing is going to head south. We've seen some light showers try to make their way in the western portion of the state, but they're really kind of working against each other because as this thing is going this way and pumping moisture this way, it's just not working out. Some very light precipitation out there this evening. We zoom in on the radar. Here we are in Flagstaff out west on I-40. Some light rainfall coming down, but for the most part, a very spotty radar. If we were to switch the radar off to western Arizona and southwestern Arizona, that's where the activity is right now. And uh, that's where the activity is going to continue before it moves down south of the state. And we'll talk about that in a second. Temperature outside right now, 37 degrees, cloudy skies, winds out southwest at 13 miles per hour. All right, so how's this thing going to shake out for us over the next 24 hours or so? Well, this storm system's going down into Mexico. It'll continue to bring rain down to the south central deserts. And then we'll see a little bit of wraparound moisture throughout the uh, early morning hours and through the day tomorrow into the eastern Mogollon Rim and White Mountain. Slight chances of precipitation elsewhere. The storm system's really taking a dive towards the south. We get beyond that, there is a ridge of high pressure building in. The good news is, or at least in my opinion, it's not a long-term ridge of high pressure. It'll last Wednesday through Friday with warming temperatures and very mild weather once again returning to northern Arizona. Tomorrow still a little bit cool. Wednesday through Friday, a big warming trend, and then it does look like we have another fast-moving storm system on the radar out there in the crystal ball for Saturday, early Saturday, during the overnight hours and into the early Saturday morning hours. And it looks to bring some widespread precipitation, but pretty quick. 22 degrees for us overnight tonight. I think the high clouds start to decrease. A mostly sunny day across the region tomorrow, a little bit warmer, 50 degrees degrees our forecast high temperature that's near the uh, average here for us in early March statewide 62 to Sedona tomorrow Prescott 60 you get down around Payson Winslow Sholo you're gonna see some showers and uh, some snow above 6,000 feet out in the White Mountains tomorrow with possibly a couple of inches of new snowfall. All right, so we got this warming trend to deal with through the week with some very pleasant weather, and uh, we'll just be talking about it and keeping an eye all week long on this uh, weekend situation for Saturday. And